Tone. Tone is the very heart of playing any wind instrument. Um, there are several parallels I'm going to draw in this series uh, between singing and playing, and this is the first one. Uh, you know, if you're out in public and you see someone sing or hear someone sing, um, it, it doesn't really matter how high or how low or how fast they can sing if they don't have a pretty voice, right? It, there has to be something inherently attractive about the way people sing in order for you to pay attention at all. Um, clarinet is, is very much the same way. The difference is that you're not born knowing what a good clarinet sound is, right? No one is. It's something you have to be trained into to, to appreciating. Um, and so this, this video is just about trying to get your ear sensitive enough so that when you're practicing, you know what to actually go for. You have a, a tonal concept that, that you're, you're trying to uh, approach. Um, you know, the best teachers are the ones that teach yourself, right? The best teachers are the ones that are eventually no longer necessary. Uh, the reason why is because, look, no teacher can practice for you. No, no teacher can practice with you, right? The majority of the progress you're going to make is on your own. So if your ear isn't sensitive enough, if, you, if, you're, if you're still thinking of, you know, just black and white playing, it's like, oh, I played this correctly, I played play, play this incorrectly, you, you're not, it's not, you're not going to get that much better, right? Um, it, you have to start asking yourself, okay, I can play this, but how am I playing it? Is it exactly, uh, exactly what I want it to sound like? Uh, uh, versus just, is it coming out? Okay, so uh, tone is a very subjective thing. Uh, people play with different tones no matter where you go. I mean, if, if I went to France, I would hear a certain clarinet sound. If I went to the UK, I would hear a different clarinet sound. Even, even in America, you have a, a large variety of, of aesthetics that people prefer. Um, I, I think the only thing that people can agree upon, at least in America, is that tone has to have a focus to it. Um, we can talk, you know, l dark light, you know, all that stuff, but focus is the only thing that distinguishes classical clarinet playing from, say, folk clarinet playing or klezmer or, you know, something that is more country. Um, so in this video, I I'm going to play a couple different excerpts, one with good clarinet tone and one with not so good clarinet tone. Uh, if you can't hear the difference, it's okay. I mean, you just have to go and listen to these over and over, or, or better yet, go find someone that you really like in terms of uh, their sound, and just listen to them over and over and over, right? Until until it gets in your ear, so that when you're practicing, you know you know what you have something to go towards. <laughs>